Well, after nearly two years of planning, officials have finally broken ground on a brand new film and television studio in Delaware County. The $85 million Sun Center Studios project is expected to create more than a thousand new jobs. Charlene Alicott has the story tonight from Aston. In a few months, all the dirt you see will be transformed into this. Sun Center Studios is expected to draw more top movie makers to our region, giving us an edge over the competition. Took a long time, and here we are. Here we are. This is my dream come true. Executive Director of the Greater Philadelphia Film Office, Sharon Pinkinson, says a facility of this magnitude has long been needed. We did the movie The Last Airbender, for example, down at the Philadelphia Navy Yard in an old uh, World War II seaplane hangar. It had no heat. It had no electricity. It had no water. Um, and the filmmakers had to come in and create all those things. They don't like doing that. You can't blame them. They're going to want to come here. The film and production hub will boast altogether 120,000 square feet of space, and a lot of what's already here at the former Tri-State Sports Complex will stay. We'll have larger facilities than generally speaking. We're going to create uh, 1,000 construction jobs, uh, nearly 500 indirect jobs. What's pretty neat, this 70-foot high, 60,000 square foot former sports complex will be transformed into a filmmaker's playground, shooting everything from commercials to film, whatever Hollywood calls for. And similar to Universal Studios, visitors will also get a chance to be a part of the action. A companion tourist facility will be built along with a 3D and 4D movie theater. This is great for our economy, and it's also great about how people feel about the place that they live. It's, it's the cool factor. Sun Center officially opens in November. Reporting from Aston, Pennsylvania, Shirlene Ellicott, Channel 6 Action News.